Hey, the men's draw here, and today I'm going to do the True Marcus challenge, but digitally. I start with a random color generator to find the three colors I'll be using, and I've had Rasta Green, Signal Orange, and Beige Grey. I then start by sketching some ideas to know what I was going to draw with these colors, and the first idea I had was a sea monster with green skin and orange hair and grey a grey tail and claws then another idea was uh, a witch with pretty much the same colouring but I wasn't quite satisfied with it uh, then I thought of some kind of zombie uh, with uh, a change in colours with a claws orange and grey hair but I still wasn't sure I wanted something more and something that would be a little more challenging I guess but yeah I started coloring to see if it, if it looked alright if I could work with uh, one of these I still wanted to try something else, so I sketched a fourth ID, and this one was a, a Jenny uh, with orange skin, uh, grey hair, and some green cloth. But I still didn't like it, so I just ended up uh, going with the with the first ID with the mermaid. So once I had decide, decided the, what the design would be, I started sketching it. Uh, the first sketch I do is more for the, the proportions and to have the pose correct. So it's, it's really loose and uh, there isn't many details. I wanted this character to look uh, scrawny and have very sharp edges except for the orange hair that would be a little more voluminous um, here I'm refining my sketch uh, because I I wanted to add some more details before going uh, onto the line art and I gave her claw-like fingers because well it's mostly an excuse for not drawing hands because I'm not really good at it <laughs> Um, here I'm drawing the hair and I wanted it to contrast with uh, her physical appearance. I gave her some sharp uh, fins and I'm not sure how effective it is to swim with but I'm doing it for, for the design, not the effectiveness. <laughs> and here I am doing the, the line art. I didn't uh, draw her eyes and uh, I simply added it with them, with the colors later. Line art is actually the, my least favorite part in uh, drawing because I, I'm not really good at it and uh, it's really time consuming and my lines are never perfect. And which is why uh, most of the time I keep a pretty loose style in which I leave uh, some many uh, imperfections. <laughs> and I had a lot of fun drawing the, the fins going out of her shoulders and forearms and it, it's something I never tried before and it, it was really interesting to see. And to draw. I decided to give her a trident to add some more detail and wholesomeness to this character so she she would have something of her own. 
and I gave her some globe in her hand. I don't really know what it is, just felt like it would be a good thing <laughs> and it would look good and yeah. So I'm now adding the color and I'm I'm keeping to the three colors I have. Uh, so yeah, I'm covering everything in green, orange and grey. Uh, the colors were all pretty well uh, dark. I didn't have some lighter tones to work with. So I tried to do the best I could with what I had. Uh, for the shading, I allo allowed myself to use a multiply to, to darken the, the colors. Because if you work with markers, you can layer them to get a darker shade of your color. So I decided I would use that on my computer. Uh, for the background, I just wanted the darkest color possible. So I layered the three colors I had. Uh, for the eyes, I just lay it two, two times uh, the grey color to make it dark and I still use the, the grey to shade the rest of the skin. I didn't have any light tone uh, as I said earlier so I couldn't do any light so it was all uh, shading and making the darkest part darker. I used uh, mostly grey and a bit of orange uh, for the fins and fingers to shade and I think it looked pretty good. I then wanted to add some more interesting lighting so I, uh, lighting. So I added a dark uh, green shade over it and some grey lines to make uh, an underwater lighting situation. <laughs> And it overall looked quite muddy, uh, and I think I, I like it like that. It suits the character, and I knew that it wouldn't be some pretty little princess with these colors. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, if you want to see more videos, subscribe to my channel, like this video, and leave a comment.